Hey folks, this is back from Zeppelin. I'm one of the co-founders. We just launched Zeppelin's official MCP server that's optimized for generating code from designs you have in Zeppelin. And here's how it works. I figured it'd be nice to show this working on a real project. So I have Zeppelin's web app here running locally on my machine. And we're going to ask Cursor to implement this design in Zeppelin. Here we've added this new section to the right panel called Code Assistance. As you can see, that is not implemented yet on the versions that's running locally. I'm going to switch over to Cursor, and here's the prompt that I have. Implement the Code Assistant Container Layer. This is the name of the layer in the design as a new component. And here's the link to the Zeppelin design. And then I'm asking it to render it in this sidebar component that I already had. So this will probably take a few minutes to run. And when it's done, I will be right back. Okay, it is now done. It took about three to four minutes to complete. So let's take a look. All right, we have the new component just like we asked for. It did a pretty good job replicating the design that we had in Zeppelin. Let's also take a look at the uh, components, the code that it generated. So we have this new code assistant component. One of the things that we really push the agent to do is to reuse existing components and variables whenever possible because the information in the design uh, including those variables and components also get passed along to the agent. And another interesting thing here is that it generated a new component for the icon. This icon did not exist in the code base, so it downloads the SVG and wraps it into this icon component. Obviously, this is a pattern that we use internally. So uh, if you follow a different pattern, it would follow that instead. And finally, uh, in the sidebar component, it just starts using this new component. Another thing maybe you might have noticed is that whenever I hover over this, the icon is bouncing a little. And you might be thinking, like, hey, where did that come from? So if we switch back to Zeppelin, we're looking at the default variant of this screen. If I switch over to hover, you will notice that there is a, an animation annotation here. Whenever I click on it, it has the bounce animation described. So the agent does not have access to just the design specs, but it also has access to uh, documentation like this annotation here so uh, it can do a much better job replicating the design intent so uh, yeah this is uh, this is the MCP server for Zeppelin if you have any feedback I'm gonna leave our discord link down below and let us know thank you